Once upon a time, there was a girl who had a dream. She longed to reign over each pond, lake, and stream. She said, every last river and the deep blue sea, all of it one day will belong to me. They'll all call me Lizzie, the ocean queen. And when I'm in power, I'll live in a tower, in a palace of prismarine. And true to her word, she got in her boat and bravely sailed away. But no empire, let alone one that floats, could ever be built in a day. Made an island of lily pads. How'd that look? Pretty bad. My first loyal subject I might have slightly killed it Axolotl, royal guards Trained them up to fight real hard And I dreamt of my own future palace But first I had to build it From Farm. How'd that go? Worked a charm. Found people to work in the market. They may have been abducted. Swapped fish that I'd caught for some emeralds, then for quartz. And I planned out my own future palace, which soon would be constructed from pre. Blocks, cobblestone and moss and rocks To make myself a sturdy base Then came the tower and spiral staircase Robbed a reef of all its coral How'd that feel? Kind of immoral To build a dome, then add to that An axolotl habitat It has problems to speak the truth Spawning mobs and a leaky roof But still it's the most glorious thing I've seen And I live here with the Strawberry and Lady Marceline In my palace of Prismarine Just across the pond grew a kingdom like no other And the Ocean Queen would learn that the ruler was her brother Jimmy the Codfather had a plan to make a dime By having a monopoly on all the server slime In the Grimlands lived Whip, an explosives engineer. He mostly cares for salmon, the only fish he holds dear. A 
rivalry between the two had caused a great divide. To condone cod or support salmon, one must now decide. Come gather round, I'll tell you a tale of action, deception, anger and betrayal. This was the moment when the cod war began. Everybody's calling it the Great Salmon Scam. Someone has meddled with my royal gods. Quip made a trip, left a calling card. A stranger swam by, he was probably a spy. So I put him in a bucket and I quarantined the guy. It's the perfect plan. The great, great, great salmon scam. Add a knife whip and line my pockets too. I would make a trade. I needed rocket fuel. He wanted some salmon, so I went and caught a ton. Traveled to his home, and so a deal could be done. I showed him my heart, he said that it sufficed He gave me the fuel They make the wings go fly fly Then we flew off and put the salmon in a lake Little did he know that he had made a big mistake It's the perfect plan The great, great, great salmon scam To tell my seedling that it was all on track So I went to see him in his empty shack Led him to the lake, then he said Start the hunt! Let my axolotls loose so they could have some lunch Whip got revenge, a final act of malice Flying monstrosities all around my palace a Continue for a long, long time. An imperfect plan. The not so great salmon scam. Alas, the Cod War was not the only conflict to be seen. More trouble was brewing that involved the Ocean Queen. Deep inside the jungle, the Lost Empire lies, ruled by Joey, a chaotic and most mischievous guy. Meanwhile, in Mythland, Lord Sausage formed a guild, where customers could pay to have their rivals killed. This is the tale of how these rulers' paths crossed, when the Queen found that one of her ocean kin lost. Isn't this an awful piece of news to start the day? I heard that Joey took my axolotl far away. And while in flight that evil thief did tumble off the tower. Still he took my baby boy, my darling little flower So I left my empire and I took a jungle trek I found his central temple and I stormed right up the steps Angered by his insolence and driven to a rage I stole the tiger blood prince and I put him in a cage Joey spying, so I put him to the test. Let us meet at sundown in the desert to the west. Nobody gets hurt, and we still both get our own way, he said. If you try any funny business, there'll be hell to pay. 
I went to visit Sausage in his empire to the south A place where many enter but few ever make it out He laughed and he said Welcome to the Assassin's Guild I informed him of the standoff and I said Have Joey killed Double crossed me, then he tossed me Joey's head. We both got what we wanted, and we got what we deserved. In our selfishness, we both forgot to self preserve. And so a double murder somehow brought us back together And now our pair of empires can live in peace forever Right? The Ocean Queen would focus on her enemies no longer She started forming plans to make her empire stronger An alliance with Mazalia, the scotched and bone-dry mesa bring the heir of royal birth that one day would replace her. And luckily, King Joel had developed quite a crush. The thought of the queen next door was enough to make him blush. So one day, King Joel sailed up to her land to invite her on a boat ride, then ask to take her hand. You could say it's a date. No, that's a boat. A cause to celebrate. A thing that keeps us afloat. I've just always felt so close to you. You live next door, so I suppose that's true. In Japan, they call it koi. Isn't that a type of fish? Italians say amore. That's a type of eel. I guess what I mean is that I wanted to say. I can't express how good you make me feel. This could be love. Real, real. Kingdom stronger. Make weapons, go to war? Just stand right on this spot here. Sure, but what's it for? Here's a proposal. I just need the ring. I'm incredibly confused. Why is it raining scaffolding? You stolen my heart. How much health have you got? My love runs deeper than the ocean So a few dozen blocks I'm saying there's an awful lot of fish in the sea But there's always only been one for me This could be love Real, real love Together four things, old, new, borrowed, and blue. She needed help to find them for her wedding day parade, and so the future bride went to visit all her bridesmaids. I set my sights on a piece of 
fruit Rare and gold, enchanted to boot With pearl the gilded farmer by my side After hours on our sandy quest Killing creepers and searching chests Pearl said Um, Lizzie, I've had one the whole time The trip was over in a hurry I've lots of something new, don't you worry She gave to me a shot of amethyst When our paths are aligned There is nothing we can't find I'll treat them with care It's the moment for a fanfare For I'll marry my Mazalian fiancé Something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue All to wear upon my wedding day Two now down, the third soon followed This time it was something borrowed From the overgrown where flowers blew Catherine said, follow me this way Toast, for I'll marry my Mazalian fiancé Something old, something new Something borrowed, something blue Something old, something new On the wedding day, all came bearing gifts, including matching tridents, bestowed by pixel riffs. The Pixandrian nomad known as the Copper King, who wandered round the world, trading just about anything. But one uninvited guest had descended on the church, to cast infernal darkness from upon his lofty perch. Zornoth was a demon, hell-bent on destruction. Intent on cloaking kingdoms with his blood-red corruptions. So now we must part from our tale of romance, to follow the pace of a diabolical death. I'm the vision from all your nightmares I'm the source of all your screams I torture and I paralyze I crush all of your dreams I'm the baddest around, I assure you The destroyer of your world So you think you can escape me, I think again, my little girl. It takes two to tango, so let me count you in. You're on your feet, so not so long. Come join my world of sin. You treat me with 
indignation But the truth is so thinly veiled The might I possess, it's a mercy The greed in you prevails The power you've always dreamt of It could be yours one day You swear it won't consume you Think again, my protege It takes two to tango So let me count you in You know the steps of not so long Come join my world of sin To you, I am a compulsion You're spellbound by my smile Give up control to me now I'll possess you for a while You lust for domination I torment you and you fawn You think you want the truth now Think again, my little pawn It takes two to tango, so let me count you in. You hear the beat, so dance along. Come join my world of sin. I seep into each recess to bow each shred of hope. Eternity, you bind me, I cut the rope. I've got tendrils in this planet. Drive me back, I'll reappear. You think you can contain me? Think again, my brother dear. It takes two to tango, so let me count you in. In your blood, so that's so long. Come join my world of sin. Meanwhile, the Ocean Queen made two discoveries. The first was an ancient tome containing many prophecies. An airborne to the ocean empire, the resolution of a never-ending feud brings unimaginable chaos that will destroy the world. The second tome told the legend of the Ocean Orb, which the Queen vowed to find and add to her treasure hoard. Her ally from House Blossom then provided her some intel. The orb's current owner was Scott of Rivendell. The elf had ventured far from his empire of snow and stumbled upon the queen in her underwater grotto. Feast your eyes as I share my glorious wares. The precious antiques, they're exquisitely rare. And magical insects, some ancient bamboo A dish of deliciously devilish stew Make up your mind, what fabulous find will it be? I don't suppose you have any glorious fit wares? I've got a fishing rod and a chanted book An iron ingot and a tripwire hook A handcrafted stick and a powerful bow A dinosaur bone and a tasty potato Make up your mind, what fabulous find will it be? I've got a deal with destiny A bargain with fate This business is bound to profit me As long as that fool takes the bait I mean, that's all very nice 
it's all very well, but I've got those things at Rivendell. I'm hoping for something a little bit new. Those boots over there look like they could do. I've made up my mind, that fabulous find is for me. They're just old leather, but one man's trash is another man's treasure. They're yours. I actually meant the shinier pair. Would they be something you're willing to spare? You know I like diamonds, you know I love gold, and teal just suits me, or so I've been told. I made up my mind, that fabulous find is for me. I've got a deal with destiny, a bargain with fate. This business is bound to profit me, as long as that fool takes the bait. for free. Rivendell has such a lot in its coffers. Surely there's something of worth you can offer. Um, of course. I've got the oldest wood from the tallest pine. The toughest stone from the deepest mine. The purest snow from the highest peak. The softest wool from the fluffiest sheep Make up your mind What fabulous find will it be? How about that robe? Not a chance. How about the owls? Absolutely not. That thing looks interesting. What thing? That thing in your hand. You've been holding it this whole time. Oh, this piece of ja I mean valuable treasure. Yes, that's what I want. So, do we have a deal? Deal. I've got a deal got a with deal destiny, with a bargain with fate. This business is bound to profit me. To now profit that me. this fool's made a deal. Destiny, a destiny. bargain with fate. This business is bound to profit bound me to now that, that this fool took the bait. The orb began to glow a strange and airy hue. Then the queen grew gills and fins, and then her skin turned blue. She'd found the orb and got her wish, but how was she to know it would turn her to a fish? I've got to deal with destiny, I've bargained with fate. This business is bound to the prophecy, am I the fool? Have I just made a mistake? Over in the mesa, Joel was sitting by his dock when something from the water came and gave him quite a shock. The heiress of the ocean flicked her tail with a swish and asked him, Would you still love me if I was a fish?